I heard somewhere recently that the Scarlet Letter is the book to read these days because of the shit going down. You know, read the Scarlet Letter. Well, I, you know, I'm not going to read it because I already read it. But, uh, <laughs> but um, it's interesting that it is in the consciousness these days, right? It's, an, it's seen as an important book. How these plays got going, years and years and years and years ago, I wrote the, them in like 1990, Jen, uh, like 1999, like 1999, right? So 1999, so a long time ago, almost 20 years ago, like in 1998 or 1997, actually, it took so long to write. I was in a canoe, okay? I know. <laughs> I was in a canoe, and if anybody's heard this story, just pretend you haven't heard it before. So I was in a canoe with a friend. We were in like Nantucket or somewhere where there's water, and it's you know, and 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 we were you know doing da 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 da, and paddling along. And I said she was in the front, a friend of mine. And I said, as one does when you are in a canoe, you make conversation. And I said, I'm gonna write a riff on the Scarlet Letter, and I'm gonna call it Fucking A. And this is what this is canoe conversation and um, she, I laughed <laughs> and I had not been drinking it was early in the morning <laughs> I thought it was the funniest thing ever she was like hey, yeah right okay and so we paddle back to shore and you you know you get out of the canoe you know the mud and I'm thinking oh this could be a good idea right okay so I had my idea and I thought, well, what do I need to do to do this riff on the Scarlet Letter? I need to go and read the Scarlet Letter because I had never read the Scarlet Letter before. <laughs> so I got myself a copy, I read through it. I thought, this is really interesting. Sat down at my computer and began writing. Ah, oh, yes, I'm doing a riff on the Scarlet Letter. How, you know, it's called, and it's called Fucking A and that's all I knew. Wrote a whole draft of the play with a character named Hester in it and got to the end and I was like, no, this isn't it. This is not working. So I wrote another draft, and another draft, and another draft, and another draft, trying to find the story. I wasn't adapting the Scarlet Letter. I was doing a riff on it, right? Like a contrafact, if any of you know jazz. You take the chords and you write your own melody, right? So it's a contrafact, actually. Okay, but all the contrafacts weren't right. They weren't right. I wasn't getting to the story that I wanted to tell. I wasn't sure what it was, even. Padding around in the dark. So I decided to start at the end of the script on the computer and push the delete button, figuring that I would delete everything that wasn't working. This is a good method. Delete, 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 delete. Like 150 pages. Delete, delete, delete. I cut everything. I got to the title, fucking A. I said, nope, that's still right. <laughs> the only thing. Okay. So when you cut things in my mind, you throw them to the off pile, right? The, the refuse pile, the garbage. So there was a pile in my mind of what didn't work. And out of that pile, I heard this voice, because I listened to the voices like Faulkner. I heard this voice going, I, I'll tell you the story of your play. And I'm like, oh, great. OK, tell me. A woman with five children by five different lovers. That's your play. And, and, the, and the children are played by the, the adults in the play. And I was like, it doesn't sound like fucking A to me. She's like, no, it's not. It's called In the Blood. I was like, oh! So I wrote that play very quickly. Boom! Huh, okay, that was nice. I sent it off to my friends. I was very proud of it. And then fucking A was very easy to write. It was as if there were twins in the womb of my consciousness, of my mind. And they, one couldn't get out because the other, they were like entangled together. And so when In the Blood came out easily, then fucking A was very easy to write.